Happy Saturday part two. If you watched the video earlier, we were at Disney earlier in the day from early morning to mid afternoon for Dapper Day. We're not so dapper anymore, we've changed. Well, our clothes have changed, we haven't changed. But we're heading out to Destination Daytona for Bike Week um, to go see Dokken and LA Guns in concert. Both bands are um, scabbed bands at this point, meaning that they're probably, you know, like one fifth or one fourth or two fifths original members. But um, Dokken is kind of Don Dokken. I mean, you're missing George Lynch. But Dokken, out of all of the hair metal bands in the 80s, was one of my favorite bands to listen to. And I know that this is going to be a disappointing train wreck, but I'm hoping for the best. And it's me driving in front of me. A little shaky. Yeah, good times. So we're up at Destination Daytona in Ormond Beach. It's not actually in Daytona, it's over in Ormond. But folks normally think about Bike Week, you think about Main Street, Daytona. But there's plenty of other spots to go to, including Destination Daytona. I believe this is the nation's largest Harley Davidson dealership. So we usually come up here for the concerts that they have every bike week because they're usually the biggest concerts in town. And you can also go to Iron Horse Saloon. That's a really phenomenal place. As well as Orlando Harley Davidson. They put on some really big shows as well. You don't want to make it all the way up to Daytona Beach. So what you see, in addition to Bruce Rossmeyer having their Harley Davidson, they have pretty much like a self-contained fairgrounds here of all kinds of things for bikes. So a lot of the stuff that you see in Daytona Beach on Main Street, you have here and actually more of a selection, I think, of like motorcycle products. And they've got their own tattoo place on site as well. You got all these bikes that are parked here. Check these out. These are sick. Sick with a capital S. Check out the paintwork on this thing. alligator skin. I got these two bikes over here too. The paint is just ridiculous. Again, all the way down to the belt. They're over here. See the brush works on the silver. <coughs> that is just incredible. You guys should know this is Eddie Trotta's Thunder Cycle Design. I'm in the sun. This guy's on stage just said, is that all you got, Orlando? And we're in Ormond Beach. Wah, wah. Oh, man, this is Orlando, bro. Uh, oh, uh, where are we at, man? You woke up in the garbage pile in Orlando. Ormond Beach. I thought this was Rock Oklahoma, dude. <laughs> Somebody didn't want this stick? Come on, dude. Oops. Come on, come get it. Free stick. It's yours for free, bro. You'll even autograph it. That's Eddie Cruz from American Hot Rod. Kicking ass tonight, man. Yeah! Bruce Ross Myers, Destination Day, Jordan Saints, and Shivers, and Saints, and Shivers, and Shivers, and Really fat. You probably shouldn't wear those pants. Hey, Jesse. What? Is there, like, we have a legendary Total Steel Pants that rip off. Who's that? Jordan Turner right there. Very funny. I don't see that. You gotta fight! You gotta fight! You gotta fight for your right to use your body! Yeah. Yeah. And you gotta fight for your right to When the whole world is on bikes, that means the cops have to be on bikes too, right? Of course. So for the most part, all of these vendors are shutting down for the day already. I mean, it only just hits 6 o'clock. 
I like this bike personally. It's here every year. Ah, Affliction Clothing has a bit of tent here too. So the one thing at Destination Daytona that is awesome is that they have this gigantic pavilion for bands to play in. They got a giant bikini contest going on in there now too. You gotta go check that out. on the camera you usually. You me telling me it's not enough. <laughs> what I liked was that the guy was nice, but he couldn't do math in his head. So I felt very badly for him, especially on Pi Day, when he added all of this stuff up and didn't come to the right amount. He couldn't figure it out. And he was just like, ah, just take it for the amount that I'm telling you.
Guns is over. Now round two of the bikini contest where Miss Destination Daytona is going to start. But the crowd is really thinned out here. I'm actually really thinking about just going to Main Street. I'd like to pick up this year's version of the Indian shirt. Some music, please. So the winner of the contest actually gets $1,000 now and gets to fly to a hard rock casino somewhere and compete for $75,000.
second place goes to Carrie. voting for other people. I voted for the second runner-up, uh, first runner-up, I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> just so you don't think it's just me being a creeper coming to these things. Mary <laughs> likes going to them too, and she's the one that usually chooses to come, so. Anyway, I'm drinking hardcore tonight too. Diet Coke. Water. Yeah, look out. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Sign reminded me as we were walking by we have, uh, patches because we normally get patches sewn on it, uh, vests and stuff at Bike Week events. But one thing you should know is that if you come to uh, Bruce Ross Mile, they allow club patches on your vests in the grounds here, which most bars do not allow when you go to Bike Week at Daytona Up Main Street. Hey, it is 11 o'clock and we are finally home. It was a marathon day between walking all around Magic Kingdom with the Dapper Day stuff. And then going out to Bruce Ross Myers for the Bike Week stuff, I am exhausted. And I still have to edit the video from yesterday. And hopefully it's a short video, because I think I'm remembering that we didn't do all that much. But And we got to get out tomorrow to Universal for uh, the Orlando United birthday anniversary meetup. So we're going to get out that way. So on that note, I'm going to get some sleep. But first got to edit the stuff from yesterday. So... I'm going to say goodbye to you guys for now. So thanks for all the likes. Thanks for the comments. Thanks for the subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys. Thanks for watching.